Hello and welcome back. <laughs> um, I'm vlogging again today. I thought I'd take you around. Now, Maddie came back a couple of days ago because Drip World was supposed to be on. Back to Brisbane. Booked and flights. booked the flights. It all got cancelled. But she decided to come up for the week anyway. Yeah. So we've just been chilling like for the weekend. We went to my brother's 30th party the other day, which was fun. Maddie finally got to meet my parents. Yeah. We all got led together. It was so much fun. But I thought I'd take you around today, maybe a bit of the next few days. Because I've got some exciting things happening and I'm sure you'll find out in the rest of the video. But we're just gonna go to the gym now. So she can't believe that I just go like this straight with pre-workout, but sometimes it works really bad. You gotta make sure you don't breathe in, otherwise like you'll cough it and you'll go <laughs> everywhere. And breathe it in straight. Well it's gonna be hit me so much. Wait, you ready for this? Uh, Stop laughing. Mm. That's so gross. Stuck. Can you put some in the bottle? <laughs> Alright, but we're gonna go to the gym, do a session. Well. Boy, I'm buzzing. I feel like you're not. That's hit me. Bro, I'm actually. It's hit me. <laughs> that pre workout's really kicked in. <laughs> do you want some? Hello, mate. Boy, do you want some? I've got heaps for you all. <laughs> Everyone's gonna know. <laughs> oh shit, my face has gone so itchy, my eyes are watering. I'm buzzing. Are you serious? Look at him. Wait, already? <laughs> Look at me, I feel it. My face is so hot right now, I feel it. Do my forehead. Already? So we just did a bit of a warm up. <laughs> our legs, start with, we're gonna do a bit of legs and a little bit of back. Alright, so I went too light on the last one, so I'm gonna try this. So it's super hard. Since I've started like filming, I've been trying to watch a lot more and try and get like cool ideas and uh, inspiration. And I can't take you. Just trying to like. <laughs> I can't take you seriously. And you're like. Make these better, you know? And I feel like the stretch is really making it better. <laughs> right, I'm done. Oh, I feel great after that. How are you feeling? I feel good. Do you? Why do I look so white? I think it's just the lighting. Oi. Is that my phone? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, how do I get out of here? I can't get out of there either. Oh, that's, oh shit, lucky. They've closed like all the garage doors. Which way do I go? Welcome. <laughs> so we just got back from shopping and yeah, I'm just chilling on the bed. <laughs> no, but um, yeah, this has been my life for the last week and a half, two weeks. I'm packing all my shit up. And I'm about to start a new life down in Sydney. I'm moving down in a week's time. So I've been a bit quiet on social media the last couple of weeks because I've been planning everything, trying to get everything sorted. But moving out of this house, my lease is up in a week. And I'm packing it all and driving down to Sydney next week to start my new life. So I've got to take everything apart. And... Pretty much, yeah. If you look, my cupboards are like empty. I've been slowly packing like little bits at a time. But yeah, I've just slept my last night in my old bed. When I'm driving down and stuff like that, I can take you along and do another vlog. But now you'll know what I've been doing while I've been a bit quiet. And all you're gonna see from now on, especially leading up the summer, planning content in Sydney. So excited. <laughs> So I finally found a car wash and my car is going absolutely crazy because the beavers keep going off. Oh, this is going to be fun. I'll put your window down while it's happening. No, what? <laughs> oh. Looks like the end of the world. <laughs> I think that's a little bit traumatic. We finally just made it and I thought I'd bring everything out of my fridge because we're up here for the next few days. We got some of these meals from this macros place. So we're gonna try some of these out. We had some yesterday and they're really good. Ah, uh, that's it, put on. <laughs> you can come help. So we just got, <laughs> you little queep. So we just got back to Maddie's place and had some dinner because we saw Maddie's mum and dad. <laughs> Get out of it. 
Um, and that was the first time Maddie had seen him, and it's Father's Day. So, but I'm going to make the bed, and then we're going to also watch a movie and then go to sleep, I think. But tomorrow I'll tell you a lot more about the move. Get out of your little fist. <laughs> I'll give you a pillow fine in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I have to deal with every single day. What do you mean? Oh, this is what I'm actually excited to deal with every single day. Because we get to live in the same city. <laughs> I'm so excited. Are you? Mm -hmm. Good, you better be. <laughs> it's going to help us so much because obviously I'm so motivated when I'm with her because we do the same thing. So we just like help each other all the time. We're going to help be able to help each other so much more, which I love. And I'm so excited for. But also just because I get to be around you more, right? Get to annoy you so much more. So happy with that. But we've been trying to be really healthy lately and it's been like so much easier when we're together, right? Mm -hmm. And like going to the gym together and everything. <sighs> but I'll tell you a bit more about the move a bit later on. No, we're going to go to bed now and watch the rest of this move from last night. Because I'm so tired. It's only 8 o'clock. It's good though. Yeah, I know. I love it because we've been waking up early. Alright, we're out. Good morning. So... We're just gonna make some breakfast. I'm gonna make some eggs, like scrambled eggs, with some stuff in it. Maddie's just out there taking some stories. <laughs> She's all dressed up, ready to go. What are you doing today? Getting some content. Content. Oh yeah, it smells so good. I wish you could smell it. Wait, keep it down. <laughs> Looks like a pizza. Like an egg pizza. My camera died again while I was making breakfast. Of course, I need to get onto that. It's like the second time in a row. It's happened with two different videos. With this video, I just wanted to let you know the whole deal about my whole situation with the move and kind of like why I'm going to Sydney and my reasoning behind that. I originally wasn't from Brisbane. My family lived further up north and I moved down to Brisbane by myself about seven years ago now, I think it was. And so I feel like the last couple of years in Brisbane, I've really felt like I wanted to move. Um, and I know, just was unsure about, I just knew in my head that I didn't want to stay there. It was just something that always kind of interested me. And I really wanted to like, I guess, like test yourself in a big city like that. And so hopefully things go well. After I quit my job in the accounting, I could kind of like work anywhere. And since I've been spending so much more time down in Sydney, I've just had so much more opportunity. And obviously I want to be super motivated with my work and all that kind of stuff. So being down in Sydney all the time with Maddie, we've been getting so much work done. I have other friends down there doing the exact same kind of thing. So when you're working from home by yourself, this can be just in anything, not just social media. It is a very kind of like lonely kind of when you're working at home by yourself, like you really don't talk to anyone. So once you're housemates or if you're living with your family, you're at home the whole day by yourself pretty much just doing work. So sometimes you can just not even speak to a human for like a whole day. And this is the side that I guess a lot of people have, but they don't actually talk about it too much. But then when you're around people that do a similar thing to you, you get so motivated and you can just bounce things off each other and you can help each other out all the time. And it's one of those things that I'm really looking forward to um, having when I'm down in Sydney. I know it's a little, little thing and it sounds a bit funny. It's really hard to explain. And this is why I originally got Pablo, because I was like, I'm gonna be at home like by myself doing a lot of work. I just wanted someone to be there because I hate just normal silence. So Pab has been the best thing ever. And he's funny and, and we're just there all the time together. And we spend every day together. But I'm just so excited. But to start with, I'm gonna be just living with um, a few of my friends. Originally, when I first moved down to Brisbane, we lived together. So we went to school together and we're like family friends and all that kind of stuff. So I'm super excited because we catch up every time I'm down in Sydney. So that's super exciting as well. But then I'll be looking at getting my own place um, in the next couple of weeks. So I think um, probably once this is uploaded, I feel like I'm gonna be moving down to Sydney within like three days after this. So hopefully getting this up on Wednesday and then I will be looking to drive down to Sydney on Saturday or Sunday and I'll be officially living down there, which is exciting. So I'll be getting home from Noosa, um, I think towards the end of this week and then I'll have a few days to pack my stuff up. But it's gonna be pretty daunting getting back there at my old house and basically just seeing all my stuff and all my housemates stuff just packed up, ready to go. And I'm gonna try and vlog um, 
my drive down and obviously the move. Yeah, I'll keep you updated with how that's all going over the next few weeks and let you know any kind of updates with my life with that kind of stuff. But yeah, I'm so excited. I feel like I'm just starting a whole new life down in Sydney. It's going to be great. So we just got some bomb content at the beach, as you can see from the previous little snap. That was a BTS. Do you like them? Mm, yeah. Do you? Uh, maybe. But you'll see them on my gram. Um, we have an hour until we have to do... F45. Yeah, Maddie's booked us in for this F45 session. And it burns 800 calories in 45 minutes. That's a good session. It's cardio. Bruh. Bro, it's good. My legs were this is so <laughs> dead just walking out from the beach from yesterday still. All right, we just arrived and I think we're running a bit late because we're supposed to be here early. What are you smiling about? Um, but I'll see you on the other side when we're not looking this fresh. Rip, how are you feeling? I feel good. I feel so much better after it. <sighs> we're going to do some grocery shopping now. And then... um. Go home, but I'm so glad we did that. I feel so much better. I'm gonna finish up the vlog here. I'll keep updating you with all the details about my move and all that kind of stuff. There'll be some more videos coming out about my move. But hope you liked the video. Make sure you like it if you did, and comment any ideas below if you want to see any videos.